I assumed you called me over to thank me again for the Michael oh, Arthur oh, rescue. Yeah. It, it was surprisingly chivalrous of you, but actually, um, I'm not the. Oh. Ooh, Luke is in the building, isn't uh, he? Uh, nope. Just Tracy. Oh, thank God. Your ingrate father has finally driven Tracy over the. You've got to go out there and do something. Uh, what do you mean? Why is it? What does that have to do with me? But Tracy's out of control. She and Luke got into this huge fight, and now she's taking out on anyone who crosses her path. Namely us. And since you are Luke's son, it's up to you to fix it. Oh, my God. Oh. Wow. <laughs> no pressure. So, uh, any uh, idea what the fight was about? Yes. Your father has finally convinced us that he is a con artist, which we already knew. Mm -hmm. He's been lying to Tracy about their marriage the entire time. What do you mean? Well, uh, Luke and, and Tracy never did get married in Las Vegas. Apparently, she was too drunk to remember the details. So she just bought it. Oh, God. Don't speak. I don't care what Luke told you to tell me. It's over, so just forget it. He was never my husband. He's never going to be. You didn't even give this boy a chance to speak his piece. Speak up now. Be persuasive. Oh, yeah, a uh, little help. But yeah, nice. I don't think anything I say here is going to matter. Uh, considering I am just another freeloading relative looking for a handout. No, no, no. You are a member of this family. You know what? None of this is any of your business. So tell Luke to give it up. He can find another sugar mama. I hear Helena's available. Tracy, is it really that easy for you to just throw away the last five years? I was the victim of a swindle. Nothing more. Yes, Luke conned you. Okay, and honestly, it's... It's actually quite amazing that he pulled it off for as long as he did. This is not helping. Right, sorry. Uh, what I think you're overlooking here is the fact that Luke made a key mistake, okay? He fell in love with the mark, madly and deeply. And I think somewhere beneath all this justified righteous anger, you love him too. Okay, so all Luke wants to do is marry you legally, right? And for the sake of his happiness and for yours. And, and, uh, and ours especially. Yes, and ours. Please just take him back. Not a chance. I'm finally free of him. And I've never been happier. Tracy loves being married to me. Well, we weren't actually married, but, you know, what's paperwork? Paperwork doesn't mean a thing. It's what's in... It's what's in here that counts. That's touching, Dad, but this one, I don't know, sounds like a big deal. Sounds like she's really upset. She's angry. She's angry. She's furious. She's spitting nails. So, I have to give her a little time. She's gonna punish me, teach me a lesson, all of that. But she'll come around. But I just have to give her enough time to figure all that out, you know? I figured you'd wind up here. Thanks for the warning. <laughs> you have a reservation? This is peak season. We're pretty full up here. <laughs> if you're hungry, your brother just cooked up a very tasty breakfast. You cook? Don't get excited. It's just eggs. Oh, no, that's fantastic. I'm starving. You're just in time. I was about to impart sage advice about how to handle a powerful, proud, and stubborn woman when she gets wise to you. I could have used that advice like a half hour ago at the court of ours. Mm. You have no manners. Oh. How is my pretty pink popsicle? Mm. Well, Tracy doesn't want to see or hear from you ever again. And I think this time she means it. I'm telling you, boys, I... I know exactly how to handle Tracy. I mean, the fact that she's over there at the mansion ripping off heads, that only proves that she misses me. She, she loves me. It'll just be a matter of time before that woman comes begging for me to come home. Dad, I, I don't think there's any doubt that Tracy loves you. That's, yeah. that's not what you're yeah. saying. I mean, she has to, you know, after all the crap you put in there. Crap I've done. That's the pot calling the kettle scorched. Hey, I'm just saying. She's hurt, Dad. She's hurt. I mean, I, 
underneath the bravado and the cutting sense of humor, I'm sure there's a sensitive human being who just wants to be loved and not taken advantage of or lied to. No, there isn't. <sighs> She's upset. And she has every right to be. Whose side are you on? Yours. I'm on your side, Dad. I'm just saying that... I don't know. I mean, maybe... You need to make a little extra effort this time. I'm not sure if resorting to your old tricks is going to get the job done. You need to step up. Reevaluate, reassess the situation. Come up with something new, man. I mean, maybe the whole anti-sentimentality thing has run its course. You should go over there, put your heart on your sleeve, and, and work some of your old Luke Spencer magic. Yeah, she won't buy that crap anymore. <laughs> no, boys, trust the old man. I know exactly how to handle Miss Spanky Angelica Quartermain. I got this covered.